Hey there everyone, this is Cow playing Blast Core, and last time, kind of a weirdly nothing stage this one, you know, it was just a train, and then we went here, uh, I mean, the other here, okay, uh, over here, and it was just like crates, I don't know, but, 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 I insisted on letting myself to this orb, because I like to have a orb in its orbit all together whenever possible. Tempest City, and I don't know what Tempest City is gonna look like. Well, Tempest City is we're back to this city escape. Except this time, instead of using the Ramdozer or the, the, the other one, uh, we're gonna use the bike with its missiles. So you have, you know, a certain amount of missiles you can use. You gotta be careful. Get right into that missile pack. Collect ammo box, you can blast your way through. Hooray! Uh, oh, it was the wrong button. What happens? Alright, so the whole thing here needs to be destroyed. And you gotta- wait, what? What is- is that? Is it- I think it's a gas tank. Well, you know what? I guess I'm dead. I- Yeah, I literally shot the tank. I'm aware of it. I feel like the Ballista's main problem is that I think it's very hard to correct when you're around something close to you. Like, you know, like I'm trying to turn, I'm trying to kind of fiddle my way there, but it just doesn't really work out, right? Ah, I thought I shot it. Alright, I'm pressing start. We're pressing go. Alright, now that has been eradicated. Yeah, Ballista is fantastic on paper. Well, in practice, it's a bit fiddly to use. Alright, there's like a whole bunch of TNT missiles left behind those trees. I don't know why. I'm not asking for a reason. I just kind of accept it. But see, once you've got like enough missiles in your in your, in your your inventory or whatever, then you just kind of let loose. You just, you just drive and you're like, alright, I did it, I guess. Uh, yeah, the whole city is clear! The only reason I struggle a little bit is you got a gas station that's like right at the entrance. Like, who puts a gas station right at the entrance of a place where people live? Absolutely ridiculous. Also, it didn't help that, you know, every time I start this game, I feel like I need like a minute to just remember my buttons. And, um, like I said, like the most dangerous part of the level is in the first minute. Alright, so here we go. We're just kind of driving around, destroying everything that we encounter for fun. Yeah, 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 these guys are panicking. That is pretty great. Uh, explosions everywhere, and we're gonna eat cake. Uh, there's something you need to explode up here. I remember that. Alright, we'll destroy this building. Survivors! There are none. So what's the deal with this thing? Okay, yeah, I think there's things up there that needs to be like shocked. And it's like not not easy. It's, like you gotta do like something like that. Like you know when you accelerate and you do a wheelie. I think. Let's just quickly go around town just to make sure. Like I've got all survivors. Yeah, so I don't have all buildings yet. Let's just take care of that real quick. It's that stuck here. Because, I mean, like, if I if I have to return and come back, and all I have to worry about is, like, what's on top of there, like, I can come back with a full complement of missiles, and it's like, alright, here we go. Time to party, Johnny. You know, what we always say. I'm still missing RDUs because I didn't get the thing about the RDUs. So I'm gonna drive around town looking for little rounds. Alright. So yeah, this is basically all that's left. It's whatever's up there. You can kinda see. Alright, so uh, I'm gonna be grinding this now. It might not be pretty. Also, there's a thing up there? Like, how do you get up there? I forgot that detail. I don't get the sense that I'm hitting what I want here. But this is as much as the camera pans out. 
All right, so like I said, I'm gonna return. Everything I've destroyed and accomplished will remain destroyed and accomplished, but all the missile packs will be back. Yeah. Hopefully we can get something going. Really? Bronze? Because I guess I'm missing a lot of buildings? Wait, I saw the color change there. But I don't know if it's like... If it means anything. Okay, no, this thing is getting destroyed, but this thing in particular. Like, it's getting all dark. Oh! So, okay. Then I can get up here awkwardly. Now I can destroy these manually like this. In a way that feels kind of garbage. But that's why this is a weird garbagey place. It's because there's a science man. <laughs> of course. All right, I might. Well, I got more missiles now. Yeah, I just got that little bit to destroy though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, game doesn't seem happy yet. All right, yeah, that's right. Pretty good going. Uh, so one of them is in Glory Cost Crossing. One of them is at the Ebony Coast. Uh, oh, and that one's you're gonna need the flying ship thing. Got it. So what else do I need to destroy? I have most everything destroyed. There's one thing missing somewhere. And, uh, I guess I have to find it. That is so dumb, though. I mean, I saw the texture change. There was a clue. Uh, I guess I'll reload the level again. I cannot tell. Like, I can't find it. Whatever it is that I haven't destroyed yet. Oh, there's a tiny little- okay, I just saw the cube. The cube is right here, against the wall. Oh, it was sneaky. Actually, the reason it was, was hard to find was because of the camera angle. But that's fine, and that's okay. It's so only a little bit of time detour anyway. And again, this I feel like this is why the game turns into like more puzzle stuff as we go forward. Because when you just kind of go around destroying things, it's fun to go around and destroy things. Sometimes I feel like there's only so much you can do. This looks to be a race of some kind. Uh, is it going to be an honest race or is it going to be a fine, find the cheat race? Okay, I think I remember this one a little bit. A meaningless statement, because we saw what that means when I remember things. It means nothing. So we just got big blocks on the road. It's pretty good. See, I immediately thought, well, all right, this road is getting really far away. Oh, I mean, there's a little passage here. Like, is that navigatable? Honestly, I'm wondering if it is. Um, like, can you not go in here? Okay, so even though there's clearly a gap between the buildings, there is not a gap between the buildings. It's good to know. Oh, but here is a path. Okay, okay, let's start this over. All right, you know what? Fine. Let's just let's just drive honestly. Go for it. Because there, I looked for a shortcut and I found an invisible wall. So, you know, as it does, but there, you know, they just kind of put arrows on the road, which seems very odd. I mean, no, yeah, like, people put roads on roads. People put arrows on roads for real, but, you know, there's... Whoa, check it out, I'm across this dirt path! Dirt path champion here, you gotta zig a bit. And then I guess you're back on the road legit. So looking at the side of the road, and yeah, I'm gonna admit it. I don't know if I've really seen any place that had a room for a shortcut. 
I mean, this really is meant to be a test of your ability to stick on the road and do road-like things that way, but, um, da -da -da. but yeah, this is like a little too vanilla. It, it worries me. It worries me by how straightforward this is. This is not how the game normally operates. So I can do that. I don't know if that was better. I mean, like, I drove more in the straight line, but, like, does that mean anything? Well, we can compare my lap times. Comparable. I mean, no, it's like, there's like half a second difference. Half a second's a lot. I'm hearing, like, shaking, like, shook, and then like, the screen was shaking, like, something was being destroyed somewhere. That's just what happens when you live in Blastcore World. Uh, I'm driving around the city, doing laps, we don't know why. I really don't know why. This kind of happens. <laughs> it's my life now. Things happening. Not a big difference. Like, if I could just get maybe the... Well, if I had this, and also if I had used the shortcut, quote-unquote, where I just don't turn for a while here, and that should probably be enough. Like, just this shortcut, if we're gonna call it a shortcut. Did it. Yeah, just no find the right angle around that building, I guess. That is so dumb. Okay, I did it! Sure, why not? <laughs> I'll claim my prize. <laughs> but I got promoted to a demolition fanatic without any demolition. I just did a wide berth around the whole track and was rewarded for that. What kind of message are you sending out here? Whoa, the message as the roads are freaking out!